Well, the, the Select Committee was asked to look into the handling of, of COVID and their uh, response was that it was probably, um, whew, I don't know, um, not very good. <laughs> no, they actually said it was the worst public health um, crisis in British history. That's right. So the government's COVID response is up there with the Black Death. <laughs> <laughs> I, I'm, not, I'm not exaggerating, I'm trying to be balanced. <laughs> so what did the report find? It concluded we didn't lock down quickly enough, we didn't protect the elderly in care homes, we didn't close borders quickly enough, no. and we were wrong to pursue herd immunity. I mean, Gavin Williamson would call that an A-star performance. <laughs> <laughs> The report was severely critical of the £38 billion test and trace system, calling it slow, uncertain and often chaotic. <laughs> Dido Harding was unavailable for comment. I say unavailable, no-one could, could track her down. <laughs> <laughs> the report did say as well that we should have challenged the science before. Well, that's right. Because I thought the science was like this one thing that everyone yeah. agreed with. Turns out there are lots of sciences and they don't always agree. But I would say that the British public, we challenge the science a lot. I mean, on my family WhatsApp group, everyone was virologist, do you know what I mean? <laughs> yeah. 